you, I am talking to you, we see you talking to you, I am talking to you, I am talking to you, I am talking to you, we see you talking to you, talking to you, I'm talking to you, talking to you, this announced you versus Pat State. Let's let, let fuck it. Let's get it popping, bro. You and Pat State, what are we going to expect? What did this battle mean to you? What's going on? Okay, it mean a lot to me because I, I always respected Pat State as one of the legends. You know what I'm saying? Battle rap legend, he got to go down as one of the legends. If he ain't a legend, he like high, high up in the Hall of Fame. He always solidified. I don't care if he don't rap another day in his life. Niggas gonna gonna respect what Pat State did, especially for for that side of the of the border. For the other, you know, out of That's out nice. of America, who was who was one of the best niggas you seen from Canada or or King of the Dot? It was Pat State, man. He done he done laid the the the, the, the foundation down. He done put the work in. You Yo, know what I'm saying? He remember. made that chain mean niggas something. Yo, when that nigga battled Mav Hoffa, when that nigga battled Arsenal, when that nigga battled Head Ice, that nigga was in his bag. Niggas got to understand that shit. He's a legend, man. So I think, yeah, so it means a lot. It means a lot just to even have a battle with him. You know what I'm saying? Like, because I remember Pat State calling me out a couple years ago on Twitter, and I was having issues with my passport, so I was like, well, I can't go over there to Toronto, so you're going to have to come to L.A. or, or wherever, Boston or some shit. We're going to do it on Massacre. You know what I mean? And then this league from Australia had hit me up. They was like, yo, man, we talked to Pat Stay. He down. Uh, we want to fly y'all down here to Australia. We're going we gonna to give y'all whatever y'all want because we want that battle. And I was like, damn, down in Australia? But but will the people respect it? Like, will the people – like, you know, when it's it's a battle that's – on one of those type of leagues, it kind of get, like, just put under the rug. Like, nobody really cares. You feel me? You but know, so when this opportunity to do it on a moot card, I thought it made perfect sense, honestly. Yo, I'm going to tell you right now. You battling on the – and I'm speaking from a fan perspective. You – well, obviously, I'm a fan of Toronto. But you battling on the moot card, ugh, I might be reaching. I kind of want to say – it's equivalent to you battling for the chain in a, only in a sense because I know that there's going to be so many eyes on this card just because Luke and Verb is on it that if you do your fucking right. thing, the shine will be, the outcome will be stupid. Everybody that I spoke to on this card, like off air, behind the scenes, have always have all said the same thing. I just want to be in the card. It ain't about the money. <laughs> you want to be, you want to be a part of the fucking rock. What? You want you want to be a part of one of these cards that mean a lot. Like this ain't this ain't no just no regular card. Like this might be card of the year if everybody come with it. This might be one of the best cards ever if everybody come with it. So it's like to just to have an opportunity to even be a part of that. You understand what I'm saying? It's like damn man, like that's that's amazing because you know Buster Ron's gonna be in the building. Maybe some NBA niggas gonna be there. A couple other hip hop artists gonna be in the building. This this shit gonna be really big, man. Like pay per view gonna be off the hook. Everybody gonna be there. Everybody's watching this shit. So it's like now, if you really want to shine, if you want to shine, this is the time to do it. This is the fucking time to show your ass, man. This ain't the time to go up there choking and then fucking up. Cause it's just as many motherfuckers that's gonna watch you fuck up as it is people that are going to watch you do great. So your stock is either going to go up or down. It, what you, what, it's mm-hmm. all on you. What you want to do? Let me ask you a question, Danny. You know, let me, I don't mean to cut you off. Let me ask you a question. As far as past day approach towards you, what do you think it's going to be? Do you think it's going to be joking wise? you think he's going to try to outball you? What you think he's going to, how do you think he's going to come to you? Based off his past Um. <laughs> You know what? See, if I anticipate him coming one way, he might come to a whole opposite approach. So then if I if I try to write in anticipation of him coming one way and he don't come that way, I, I'll mess myself up. You know what I'm saying? So I, I'm i pretty sure we're going to get some jokes. I mean, that's kind of standard with every past day battle. You know the jokes are coming. You know what I mean? Like, I can just see me – 
going cra- let's say I go first, right? I can see me going crazy, right? And then he and then he just starts his round off like, Wow, you're 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 really fucking sweaty right now. You know what I'm saying? I can just see him saying some shit like that and everybody's laughing. Like it, it, he knew yep. how to defuse bars. You know what I'm saying? He got angles. Uh he he can do personals, he can do that, uh I'll fucking kick you over the fence like a soccer ball. You fucking you're not as tall. You don't want a brawl. I'll fucking, you know, I, I can just see him doing that bully shit he does, and then he gets into the multi syllabic rhyming. Yeah. But if he try to, if he tries to go brawl for a bar with me, that's where he gonna make the ultimate mistake. He needs to just stick to doing what he's doing. I need to stick to doing what I'm doing. But like I was telling man, if I go up there and try to joke it out with him, I'm stepping into his world, and then I'm gonna get killed. Exactly. And then niggas gonna be mad at me like, damn, Danny, why you just didn't, why you just didn't do what you normally do? So I can't, so I can't fuck you, up Danny, like that. Danny, if you do that, that is not gonna work. I don't even want you to even think like that. That ain't gonna work, bro. That's why. That's what I'm saying. That's why I just said, if I try to step into his lane, I'm gonna fuck up. And if he try to step in my lane, he gonna fuck up. I think we both just need to do what we both do, man. You know what I mean? Let us let us just do what we do, and and whatever happened, happened. You know what I mean? And. That's that's why we watch battle rap because we we want to see what's gonna happen. We want to see what works and what doesn't work. So I'm True. not gonna step too much out of my fucking lane, but you know I got a couple tricks up my sleeve, man. You feel me? Like I'm well rounded. I think I don't get enough credit. I think people just think, oh, then he's bar 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 punch punch bar bar punch punch. Like no, nigga, like you you're not paying attention. Watch me versus B dot. Like I can I know how to write. I know how to adjust to the opponent. You know what I mean? So we we going to see. It's going to be fun, though. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. It's just like it ain't no pressure. I was saying it, it's not about, oh, shit, the whole world watching this shit. I'm under a lot of pressure. Like, nah, man. Like, let's. I'm at, I'm at the point where I'm just really up here doing what I love to do, man. And I, I'm going to get a people a show. I know he's going to bring the show. I'm, a, I'm, I'm coming to kill this man, though. All right, hold on, I'm going to ask you, is it just me? All right, boom. When when Pat Stay was in Canada, the nigga then there looked unbeatable, bro. But once he started making his American tour, then he looked kind of beatable, bro. Then he started losing. Ah, oh, man, like, don't be giving away my bars, man. <laughs> <laughs> we can't even talk about it. I'm going to just rap about it. I'm going to just rap about it. I ain't, gonna, I ain't even going to answer that. I, I'm, I'm going to rap about that. I remember when Hell. he was that nigga it was like two, three years ago, brother. He definitely, that right. That definitely cool, and I don't give a fuck what nobody say. It has, bro. It has. It's it's fun. Yeah, we gonna he talk about it. Cool. We we talking about it. I'm leaving alone. I know he what I know what to do. I, I, he's fired, but and listen, I don't. But and look, me knowing that, me knowing that he was once like invincible to becoming human. Like I don't want to make the mistake. And, and and underplay him or underestimate him, and and go in there thinking he regular Pat Stay, and then this nigga be back to the Canada Pat Stay on me, and then I get fucked up. <laughs> you feel me? Like I'm sure. not finna, I'm not finna underestimate. I'm going in there like he's invincible Pat Stay. That's the mindset I got. Mm-hmm. I'm I'm rapping. I'm writing for the invincible Pat Stay, because just in case if that if I get that one, at least I can be able to fight back. Now, if I just write for regular past day and he come invincible, then I'm gonna lose. Clear, I'm gonna get my ass kicked. And I, ain't, I you, you know me, man. I don't, I don't go in there to lose. I'm not going in there to get my ass kicked. So you, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm coming to kill. Huh? Word. I said you gonna get your ass kicked on the popular ass card in front of Mook and a whole bunch of superstars. Yeah, man, don't nobody want that, man. You don't want to be the nigga that die on this card. You know what I'm saying? I don't mind nobody losing because it's going to be a winner and it's going to be a loser. I don't mind nobody losing. It's okay to lose. But if you get your ass kicked, that's different, bro. That's that's, yeah, that's embarrassing, different. man. Don't don't get embarrassed, my nigga. If you if, if you you and your man have a, a a crazy classic and it's back and forth, back and forth, and it's the third round, it's tied up, and then he just kind of edge you, then fuck it, he got you. Okay, whatever. You feel me? That's acceptable. You can move on. But if you go in there and get three old, if you go in there and choke, stumble, get get molly watched, 
Ain't no fucking excuses for that, man. That's unacceptable, especially on a card of this magnitude. Everybody needs to be on their best shit, or at least as best as they can they can be. I'm not I'm not finna get embarrassed. I can tell you that right now. If Pat State beat me, he beat me. But he not finna it ain't gonna be no Pat State kill Danny Meyer. It ain't that's not happening. Niggas can get that out their mind right now. I'm coming for the I'm coming for the nigga's soul. Get it I'm out coming of, for niggas get soul. Out of their mind right now. Yeah, stop all that shit. Ain't no Danny finna get killed three old and Pat State finna embarrass him and joke him out of there. That's a hey, man. I'm not the I'm not the one, bro. I'm not the one. I'm the one that, that try to go in there and embarrass niggas. I'm not trying to get embarrassed. So that go for any nigga on the car. Niggas got to be on their best shit all three rounds. All three rounds. Don't get three old. That's all I can tell everybody. You going you to look crazy. That Definitely too. Y'all, crazy. niggas know how I do when I'm on RBE, man. First of all, niggas know how I am every time they see me, no matter what stage it is. But the last time niggas see me was me versus Chilla Jones on RBE. Went fucking crazy on Chilla. I went retarded on Chilla. What? So on my return back to RBE, man, man, get your pay per view. If if you, <laughs> get some pay per view, man. That's all I can tell you, man. I am back. I am back on RBE, and I'm finna show niggas, man. I'm really one of the goats at this shit. I ain't playing with none of these niggas. Y'all find y'all gave me another legend. I got a I got a legend. I got an official legend. Legend this time. This ain't this ain't oh Danny Myers versus Show Off. Danny Myers versus Jay Murder. Nah, bro. This is Dang Mike versus Pat Stay. Mm. Mm. This ain't no regular battle right here, bro. Some niggas say, "Oh, that's a it's a weird matchup. It's a style clash." Them be sometimes them be the ones that make classics. Niggas was saying that about Iron Solomon and Rum Nitty when they first seen it. Oh, that's kind of oh man. I don't want to see no Nitty and Solomon. That shit whack, man. That's a that's a weird clash right there. And then it, then when it came out. What was everybody saying? Tell me. Same possible. thing. Me and Pat State going to be the same shit. Same thing with Math and Chilla Jones. Same thing. Math and Chilla Jones. It be the weird style clashes that give you the best battles, man. So, when me and Pat State, I think y'all going to... Huh? I said, you want to be real. Tay Rocky Goods. Oh, the, hey, man. That was a good-ass battle. That was a good battle, man, and I wasn't expecting nothing from that. Hell no, me neither. It had, it had a couple I shaky moments, but overall, that was a, one of the better battles. I think that was, mm-hmm. I think that was the second best battle. I think Twerk and Suge was the best battle on known, and then I think it was Goods and Tay Rock, and then followed that by Surf and Nitty. You know what I'm saying? So or maybe, good. maybe <laughs> even Loso and Scotty. You know that like. That shit was that was a good battle too, you know what I'm saying? But I think like a style class like me and Pat Stay, people might not expect much from it, but watch. I think we're gonna surprise a whole lot of people, man. So I'm like I said, man, I'm going in there to kill him. I know he's coming in there to kill me. So when you you know what I'm saying, when you got two niggas on a mission to kill each other, it's it's gonna be a great battle. That's all I can say. May the best man win. Man, this shit about to be fucking crazy, man. I want to see this shit. Yeah. This shit about to be crazy. You, you finally somewhat, you finally somewhat getting your respect. You know what I'm saying? You got Absolutely, twerk, you got absolutely. I went from K. Shine, New Jersey twerk, and you know, even though he knew he's one of the hottest fucking things in battle rap. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I, I got that. So shout out to uh, K. G. Nim and, and U. R. L. for doing that. And then shout out to ARP for giving me the, the opportunity to be on the card, first of all, and then to be battling Pat State. Like, that, that's showing me a lot of respect. That's showing me a lot of respect. But like I said, if it had been, like, uh, Jay Murder or Shaw, and not to, not to downplay them, but then people would have been like, oh, man, Danny kind of need, like, a better name than, than Jay Murder. You feel me? Like, I, I got past, I got somebody who I'm supposed to be matched up with. Like, these are the caliber guys – that I and from now on and listen, from here on out, them them the only type of battles I I'm going to be in. 
as far as the the, okay. the big the major leagues go, that's the only battle of caliber of guys I'm taking from here on out. Like I said, man, next year I'm taking Hollow, I'm taking Iron Solomon, I'm taking Head Ice. I'm I'm listen, man. Next year, that's it. Hopefully, like I said, hopefully we get uh Tay Rock Traffic Four. You know what I'm saying? If I if, if let's just say the Tay Rock shit don't happen at traffic, I'll, I'll at least take O Red or or even Briz Rothstein at traffic. You know what I'm saying? That's the lowest I'm gonna go. Is Briz and O Red? That's the lowest I'm gonna go from here on out. The rest of my career, I'm only that taking legends, like, man. Yo, it needs to be like that, man. It actually does. It gotta it be, be like, like that, that cause cause if I don't respect myself like that, then the, the leagues ain't gonna respect me. They ain't gonna they they're gonna exactly. keep giving me oh oh here oh here here take take uh take Joe take take Jack Boy take Ryder, you know what I'm saying? Like I done did I done did enough favors. I did enough favors. I took Steams. I took Guizzi. You understand what I'm saying? Like it's certain battles that I wanted. Like I wanted the the young cannon battle. I wanted that. That was a personal war that I wanted on my resume. Joe Nye, that's another battle that I wanted to do. Saint Mike. Oh, that's okay. a battle that I, I I wasn't looking for the Saint Mike battle, but when it was offered, it was like, hey, why not? He one of them pin game niggas and he underrated, he fired. I'll take the Saint Mike battle. You know what I'm saying? But that that was it for that was it, man. I got a I got a couple couple uh off brand battles that I'm gonna do in between the, like for this year just from some shit that I had prior favors and shit. But as after the patch after Torgan patch stay as far as the big leagues go, I'm only taking legends, man. That's it. No, that's it. That's I'm done. I can't be <laughs> damn near forty still battling niggas that's coming out of the PGs. Like I'm not that dude. Like y'all niggas gonna respect me as who the fuck I am. I done put the work in Not over the years. I, I mean, put the work in like over that. the years. Yeah, I done, mm-hmm. I done did enough. I did enough small names. I did enough favors. I did enough mid-tiers or whatever y'all want to call them. I did all that already. I'm done with that part of my career. That's mm-hmm. what I mean. Like, after past State, bro. And, and past State is, like, really the start. Past State is, like, the start of my legend run. It's the start. Yeah, that's the start of my my legend run. Like when I mean legend is like it's from after the Pat Stay battle, you only gonna see me with legends. Or I'm just not gonna battle. I'm not gonna accept this guy or that guy on, on no major league. On no main on no major league, no. I'm not accepting no, nothing other than legend. Or I just won't okay. battle no more. That's it. I'm not battling if it ain't a legend. You if you can't give me a legend, don't don't call me. No. I'm not doing it. Okay, it's, okay. It's time for these other okay. niggas to be taking taking those type of battles. Let them work their way up amongst each other. Don't let a nigga just skip the line and say, oh, I got dang dang Myers, man. Mm, nah, that's oh, over. Sorry. That, that, that door is closed. I'm talking to you. I ain't 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 talking to you.